so here we are I just want to show you a very easy way of how I use the Willow and Plum soap which I've mentioned in previous videos about how good it is uh, on a lovely Briard called Honey I've just got a little restraining loop so that she doesn't try and roll off but we've got some fantastic tangled knots uh, and I'm going to show you how easy it is so first of all with my comb you can see that that's going to take quite a lot of pressure to pull out yeah which is not going to be very comfortable for honey so what I'm going to show you is how we use the soap to get rid of that so in the same place what I'm going to do is just dry wipe using the dry soap into that area which has got all the mats in and then I'll show you how easy the comb goes through yeah so just a little bit of soap and then just combing through you'll find that's a noticeably easier way of combing out that matted area so as you can see just a little bit of pressure which is always the case I'm sorry honey and you'll find now that's another badly matted area but the area that we wanted and with dry wipe and so has come out a lot more easier so another top tip is to make sure you use your soap now not just any old soap Willow and Plum soap company their soap because it's all natural ingredients and it's the shea butter and the coconut oil that really helps to get into that tangled area without making any chemicals on the dog's skin which is an important thing and you'll find that the area that I've just wiped will comb out a lot easier so a dog like this wonderful large Briard um, that's got lots of mats and is prone to matting use the soap it nourishes the coat so it will lie flat later on uh, it will smell nice according to whichever fragrance you want to use but most importantly, it's a nice, easier way of getting the knots out of your dog um, in a very gentle and kind way, because the most important thing is we don't want to hurt the dogs. So why don't you give it a go and see how you get on. Thank you so much.